Handicapper Steve here, handicapping the racing from Sandown Park here on Saturday. It is the 5th of February, 2022. Going to look at the fourth race of 220 from Sandown. But before I get on to that, remember to please follow me on Twitter at Horse Racing Kid 5 for more selections for race courses around the world. And I mean around the world. The fourth race of 220, it is the Grade 1 Skilly Isles Novices Chase. It's a Grade 1 event for Class 1 horses going for a purse of $108,000. Race for novice 5 rolls and upwards. We have 5 horses going for Four thousand meters or two miles over or two miles and one half over the chase course i'm going to take the four horse mr coffee as an upset here as a top selection we'll go four five three in the tri cash trifecta four five three tri cash trifecta top selection of four horse mr coffee is seven year old gun by authorized nick of is on this one for nikki henderson the horse's most recent out of game boxing day at kempton two miles nine sixteenths in class three novice limited handicap chase stepping down in class he finished second by in three quarters length they took the blingers off and i thought that really concentrated him that day he jumped well he quickened up a lot you know nothing bad about that run coming back to stand down where he's run very well in the past over the smaller obstacles come to the bigger obstacles again and today, I think it could really run a good race and upset here. I do not trust any of the really short priced horses here. Two back, he ran a new bear on the 26th of November, two miles in the class three novice limited handicap chase, and he finished third by four and a half lengths. First off, the refreshing, he needed the race, but he showed potential early on. Not the world's worst race for him. And then prior to that, at Aintree on the 9th of April, two and a half miles in the grade three per attempts network handicap hurdle. He finished fourth by five and a quarter lengths as a very, very lukewarm six to one favorite. He just, you know, moved a little bit late, but he still needs something there. Uh, in, in the long run. Maybe a three-mile trip would have suited him better there. And then prior to that, the 21st of February at Newberry, uh, two miles in the grade three bet fair hurdle. He finished seventh by ten lengths, and just the wheels were spinning, and he just never really got into it. I do think the two miles was short for, for him there uh, over the smaller obstacles. But um, he's run twice here at Stand Down. Once uh, during a Tingle Creek meeting of 2020, two miles enlisted handicap hurdle. He finished third by nine lengths, and again, too short of a trip, but he was getting around the race course well there. And then prior to that, uh, on the 8th of November of 2020 here at Stand Down, on soft ground, two miles in a class three handicap hurdle, where he won by five lengths and took off clear. Like I said, he was running good in those two mile races, but it was always too short. Two and a half miles is really up his alley. He's running good over the bigger obstacles. I think at 1220, sitting on a very good run. We're going to use him here today. So to recount my selection for the fourth, the 220 from Sandown, it's the grade one Skilly Isles and Novices Chase. Let's take the four horse Mr. Coffee. Let's go four, five, three in the Tri Cash Trifecta. So good luck to all. Please follow me on Twitter at Horse Racing Kid 5. Good luck, everybody.